B, one of Japan's busiest cities, has disappeared from the surface of the Earth. Today, where the city used to reside is now a huge crater as deep and dark as the abyss, adorned with the most outlandish of environments. Among them is an unusual tower, so to speak, that points toward the white moon above the skies. The people who thrived in that city are now monitored by creatures known as Marchins, who unduly torture the people day in and day out. Time has passed to where the name of the city is lost. Now, people there refer to this living hell as The unescapable living prison, jail. All right, I don't see any enemies around. Now's our chance to make our move. This place is really creepy. I can only hope everyone is safe. I can at least tell they're alive. And a lot of them, too. This is a bit scary, but I'll do my best. Don't you worry, my princess. I'll protect you no matter what. I can't believe you said it with such a straight face. But thank you, Otsu. That smile on your face is all I need from you, my dear little mermaid. That said, Red Riding Hood sure is taking her sweet time. Oh, sis! What took you so long? <laughs> Sorry about that. I just didn't expect so many of those monsters around. It doesn't help with you going in weapon ablaze. Now, now, Otsu. Sis did take care of them, so we can go in nice and safe now. Yep. I like my approach simple, straight, and to the point. No beating around the bush. I was trying to say that rushing in without us could be dangerous for everyone. Absolutely fine. You haven't been sleeping much, have you? Why not go and beat some monsters up? Should wake you up. I'm not like you, Red Riding Hood. Aww, now you hurt your big sister's feelings. Joking aside, pay attention. Fighting without a clear head is pretty darn dangerous. You don't have to tell me that. This will all work out, right? Don't you worry, my princess. We're only a few steps away from meeting the Blood Maiden. Acting like a prince only in front of Mermy, huh? What? Do you want to be treated the same? Hell no! Well now, you two. I can only hope that our newly found Blood Maiden is safe. If she really is a Blood Maiden, she should easily be able to take some torture. I doubt she's like you. Now then, to the cell where our Blood Maiden awaits, so that... <clears throat> A marchin! I knew they wouldn't let us through that easily. Stay behind me, my princess. Now, come at me! Uh. 
Um, here I go. Here I go. I'll cut you to bits. We won.
go. I'll cut you to bits. We won! This 
we won.
come! Here I go! Here I go! Get a hold of yourself! I'll cut you to bits! I'll crush them all! Level up! <laughs> like it had any chance against me! Unbelievable. It could have caused us major hurt. <laughs> Did you think I would lose to this grunt of a marchant? I'm trying to say that it could have hurt my princess. You're like a rock, so I could have cared less. What'd you say again? Oh, stop it, both of you. This is no time to be fighting. I'm sorry, my dear princess. Sorry. Well, let's get looking for our new blood maiden to be. I'll check from the far end then. Be careful, sis. Don't you worry about me. I can take care of myself. I wonder if she'll be okay. Please, put a smile on your face. Your sad expression is not befitting of you. Otsu... Red Riding Hood is very strong. I'm sure she will be fine. Now, let's get searching from the cells here. Look at all those prisoners. Yes. Whoever is behind this must be punished. Princess, let's splash this blood on everyone. I see. A blood maiden reacts to March in blood by her eyes turning pink, so it will help us find her. Precisely. It lacks elegance, but we really don't have much time. We'll apologize to them later. Let's start right away, then. I'll check the other cells. I'll save you all, but please, bear with me for a moment. Now then. Yikes! What the? What did you just splash on me? Ah! What's with this pink liquid? Don't you worry. It's nothing harmful, but I do need you to bear with me here. Not her. Not her, either. How about her? Are you okay, Hikari? What the hell is this about? Don't worry, Mamaru. She just caught me off guard. She just splashed you with who knows what? And you, what the hell are... I'm sorry about that, my lady. That liquid is of no harm, really. Here, wipe your face with this. <sighs> Thank you. Yeah, and this is coming from the person who caused all this mess. Now then, my lady. I'll come and save you when my duties have been fulfilled. Hey, I was talking to you! Perhaps that cell there. Alice, look at you. Hurry, lick my blood! But, but Jack, I'm just a burden to you. That's not true. Hurry! Alice, are you all right? What was that for? I found her. You did, Otsu? Look, her eyes. So pink and pretty. She's the Blood Maiden. Um, who are you guys? We are Dawn's Blood Maidens. We came looking for new allies. Alice, was it? We came for you. Blood Maidens? Allies? What are you talking about? Uh, well... Otsu! You found the Blood Maiden? Whoa, good work! Her eyes are nice and pink! Alright then, you're coming with big old sis! Ah, what are you... Uh, let me go! Sis, where are you going? Wait up, Red Riding Hood! She's too happy to notice anyone else. Follow her! I'm so sorry. Let me assure you Alice will be all right. I don't know what's going on, but let Alice go.
something. Those shackles off of you. you. You're gonna let me free? Of course. That's why I saved you. Finally, caught you. Red Riding Hood, stop moving around like that. That was dangerous. Well, gee, I was just so happy. I mean, we've lost a lot of blood maidens, so you know. You're always like this. You should really learn to stay calm and focused. No, no, Otsu. We did save Alice here. Who are you? Yeah, we did save... Alice, was it? Guess our work here's done. Let go of Alice! Jack! Huh? Who's that? He's the person who was imprisoned with Alice. Didn't you notice? Of course not. Not like I was interested. Jack, was it? I'm so sorry for our comrade's rude behavior. Who are you guys anyway? We came here to liberate the prisoners. And to find the Blood Maiden who was captive. Are you telling me I'm one of you? Yup, you're a Blood Maiden. The very one we've been looking for. The Marchin blood that was on you turned your eyes pink, which is proof of you being a Blood Maiden. Marchin blood? You splattered her with that? Come on, that's the only way we could find out who the Blood Maiden was. Regardless, we would like to ask Alice to come and fight alongside us. Of course, you can come along with us too, Jack. This is all happening so suddenly. I'm not sure how to respond. In the first place, what's the deal with this Blood Maiden thing anyway? We would love to explain, but it seems we have an undesired guest here. Looky here, a Marchin. Marchin? Alice, we need to run! No, it's too late. It pains for me to ask this, but it would help if you fought with us. Alice, here! A sword? I've never used one before. Don't worry, you should be able to use it fine. Okay, I'll try my best then. Okay, let's go! An enemy! Prepare yourself! Leave it to me! Take this! I'll crush them all!
My turn.
d'accord.